Hello everyone, I'm Seth with Exotic Motorsports and this is our 2009 Chevrolet Corvette 3LT. This has 30,861 miles on it. Front end looks really good. It does just have a few imperfections here and there, but nothing serious. Very, very minor blemishes. You have to get really, really close to the paint to see them. Very, very small rock chips, kind of uh, intermittently scattered throughout the front. Not a big deal. Really, they're very difficult to see. The paint hides it well. Beautiful cyber gray metallic. Front driver's side fender. Looks great. Has just a few small blemishes towards the front here. A couple rock chips. Very difficult to see. Fender looks really good. Front driver's side wheel does not have any imperfections. Driver's side mirror, just a couple very small rock chips. It does have uh, paint protection film over the mirror cap. Driver's side door looks fantastic. Driver's side rear quarter panel. Also in excellent shape, no issues. Rear driver's side wheel, really good shape as well. Moving along to the back, looking at the back bumper. The topmost section looks good. The lower area also looks really good. Polished exhaust tips look fantastic. Few very tiny rock chips in the back, nothing very significant. Um, here on the very top of the back bumper, we do have some rather decent sized scratches. Uh, there's a few of them that run, you know, from that distance, so probably 18 inches or so. They don't look to be very deep though. I might be able to get them polished out. Back end looks pretty good overall. Looking at the passenger side now, rear quarter panel, no issues there. Looks fantastic. Rear passenger wheel, really good shape. Chrome is very bright, looks very much, uh, I guess it looks really fresh. Doesn't look faded or old or anything like that. There's a pretty decent sized scratch across the passenger door, starting at about here. Nope, actually I think it runs the length of the door all the way down there. Uh, it's not deep at all. It does not stand out. I kind of had to look for it and let the sun hit it just right for me to really be able to find it. Passenger mirror looks great. And the front passenger fender is also in really good shape. Front passenger wheel, flawless like the other three. I'll go ahead and walk around the car from a one foot distance to give you a better big picture idea of the overall condition of the car. Here at Exotic Motorsports, we do these comprehensive walk-around videos to give our out-of-state buyers the confidence and peace of mind they need to purchase a vehicle from a site unseen if they choose to do so. Walking around a vehicle from a one-foot distance is a lot more indicative of what you might notice on a day-to-day -day basis and helps separate the larger, more obvious flaws from the smaller, less significant ones, giving you a more accurate visual of uh, kind of how you would see the car day-to-day -day if you were to own it. So obviously you're not going to comb over the paint from a half inch away looking for defects every time you get in the car to drive it. Overall I do think this is a very clean C6. So looking at the interior, we do have black leather door panels, memory seats, power locks, power windows, uh, one touch for driver and passenger, power adjustable mirrors, heated perforated leather memory seats with the ebony finish. They look great. It is power adjustable for forward and back, and then uh, manual for pivoting the seat forward and back. It does have custom JL audio speakers in the doors, and it does also have an amp and subwoofer. The audio overall sounds great. Push button start, like every C6 is. We do have power telescoping steering wheel. So that's super nice to have. 
and then the uh, tilt is actually manual. Kind of an interesting combination there that Chevy didn't choose to do power for both, but it is what it is. Automatic transmission, traction control, do have a kind of carbon fiber uh, pattern center console here. Looks really nice, not overdone, very tasteful. We also have navigation. There it is, dual zone automatic climate control. As I mentioned before, heated seats, auto dimming rear view mirror with compass and OnStar. Do have universal garage door controls there as well that you can pair with your garage door opener. Heads up display, hopefully you can see that. Kind of far off in front of me, but um, very readily visible, very easy to see from inside the car. Condition of the upholstery is great. The seat looks really, really good. Just a very minor amount of creasing in the leather, but overall looks really good. The dash does not have any kind of UV damage or any signs of wear. Dash looks fantastic. All the panels on the interior have a very dark, um, rich black tone to them. Nothing looks washed out, nothing's faded. The steering wheel does not have any wear on it. The steering wheel looks perfect. All the buttons are in great shape. Has paddle shifters as well. Cruise control, toilet sensing headlights. Window controls, mirror, seats, locks, everything. Um, all the buttons are in perfect shape. The interior looks brand new. No issues with the interior. This car looks really good. And the best part about getting a second generation C6 or the refreshed C6 is that it comes with the 6.2 liter aluminum Chevy V8, the LS3. Awesome engine. Definitely a step up from the aluminum 6 liter 6.2. The LS2. The LS3 is a great engine. Um, very good drivability, very low, uh, very good low to mid-range torque um, in the stock form. It sounds great, it feels great. And if you uh, prefer to modify your vehicles, you know, do bolt-ons, things like that, the LS3 engine takes the bolt-ons very, very well. Very easy to make power with. Idle on this is very quiet, very smooth. It sounds very healthy. The shifts are really smooth too, but still deliver it. It doesn't, uh, RPMs don't float, doesn't feel lazy. This car feels very healthy and is incredibly fun to drive. Corvette's an amazing car because they're very competent on the track. They're fast, they handle very well, but they're also incredibly comfortable for long drives. They have plenty of creature comforts, such as navigation, premium audio, heated leather seats, things like that. And they have a ton of cargo space in the back. That back hatch can hold a pretty fair amount of stuff. So this car is incredibly versatile. Whether you want a car just to get around in town, uh, a nice weekend car, a track weapon, whatever you want to use this for, the Corvette will accommodate. So that is our 2009 Chevrolet Corvette 3LT. If you have any further questions, please feel free to check out our sales listing on our website at exoticmotorsportsok.com. Thank you for watching.